Let's talk DJ cables for a second. If you've got a DJ controller, you need to watch this. So your DJ controller on the back has got a USB-B. That's what the big kind of clunky one there is that plugs into the back of your DJ controller, right? That's called a USB-B. The one that plugs into your computer used to be called a USB-A, the kind of big rectangular kind of one that you had to get the right way around. But now they're not. Like my MacBook here, for instance, is USB-C only. And a lot of computers nowadays are USB-C only. If you want to plug into a, an iPad, it's USB-C only. They're becoming the standard. But DJ gear doesn't come with USB-C cables. It comes with cables that are a version of this one I've got here, where you get the one that plugs into the back of your controller and the one that plugs into the old style kind of computer connection. So this is useless. We can't use it. We need to use an adapter like this, which just adds something extra in, and it's not ideal. So what do you do? Well, you go and try and find a USB-B to USB-C cable, like this one here. I found this on Amazon. And you know what? It's rubbish, it's thin, it's cheap, I've got no confidence in it, and I couldn't find good USB-B to USB-C cables that would work with DJ controllers until now. So thank you to our friends, bye-bye, our friends over on DJ Tech Tools who sent us bloody loads of them. All nice and colorful, all good quality, and all with the stuff that you need, which is the USB-B on one side and the USB-C on the other. Voila, we can now plug into our DJ controllers with a cable that we can trust that's not going to break in two minutes and that does the job without an adapter. Surprisingly hard to find and DJ Tech Tools in the US now stocks them in a load of colors. So well done to DJ Tech Tools for that. We're, we're impressed. Thank you for sending them over. And while we're talking DJ Tech Tools cables, because they sent us over another one as well. Now their cables, their audio cables have always been pretty popular with DJs because they're good quality audio cables, but they're not up there at the high prices that some companies charge for similar cables. And this is an example of one I've got here. It's just a standard RCA to RCA cable. And USB, uh, sorry, RCA to RCA cables like this have been in the DJ Tech Tools range for a while. But the thing that's new about this that I've noticed is that they've got two different colored plugs now. And just that little thing makes all the difference because they used to have the plugs the same color as the cable. By the way, you can get these in all kinds of colors and stuff as well. Uh, but they used to have the plugs the same color as each other and the same color as the cable. So it was hard to tell which was left and which was right when you were plugging them in. And now it isn't because they've just done the, the kind of standard but also sensible thing of making one of them a different color. So they're still quite quirky. Again, you can get these in all kinds of colors, but we like that. It was a nice improvement on cables that we've been using anyway for a long time. You'll have seen us using these in the studio. They're just good uh, and they're a, a good little company helping DJs out with stuff that they need that you can't find elsewhere. But the one for us that we like is the new look USB-C to USB-B cables from DJ Tech Tools. So there's a, a little write-up of these that's linked underneath where you can also get through to their site and find out more about these. Well done, boys. Thank you for sending them over. You will be seeing them in our school, in our lessons, in our tutorials, and in all of our demos from now on, I'm sure, whenever we need to plug in something to our MacBook, which is pretty often. So thank you very much. Till next time, get good, get out there, make the moments from me, Phil, in the Digital DJ Tip Studio. Bye-bye for now.